guys, I'm Rebecca Louise and you're watching X Hit. Now, I know we've already done a Victoria's Secret butt workout, but today it's the Miranda Kerr butt workout. So it's a little bit longer, so we really are gonna give those butts a blast. So let's take it down to the floor. We're gonna do a various number of exercises. The first time we do it through, it's all gonna be for a minute. The second time, 30 seconds. So we're gonna take it into a bridge first. So we've got a minute, squeeze up the glutes, take it down, but don't drop it to the ground. Okay, you've got one minute of this. This is a great thing that you can do when you're watching TV. See, my TV's right there. I can easily do this exercise while watching the TV. That's it. So when you come down, don't touch the ground. All the way up, squeeze those glutes up there for 10 seconds and come down. Now, you might have noticed a little friend of mine that's in the background. He's actually asleep, so shh, 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 quiet. <laughs> oh. Morning, Alfie. Um, he's going to be my assistant again today. So he's going to be helping me out, giving me in some encouragement. <sighs> he's, he's a great workout buddy, isn't he? Really inspiring, motivating, <sighs> energetic. <laughs> okay, let's keep it going, guys. <sighs> That's it. Squeeze into the top. Coming down, and we're going to change over onto the other exercise. <sighs> okay, let's change it over. So, coming onto your front. We're going to do the famous fire hydrants. So, starting with your right leg, we're going to take it out to the side. We've got 30 seconds of these. That's it. You just want to keep your leg out at the right angle as it comes out to the side. Keep those abs engaged. Pull it in. And we just want your arms to be straight underneath your shoulders. And he is really falling asleep now. <laughs> okay, let's keep it up, guys. Now this is quite a long, you know, uh, workout on our butts, but it's really uh, going to strengthen those booty muscles. Okay, so we're going to hold it up here. We're going to pulse for 15 seconds. And the great thing is, is that you can follow along the time on screen. We've got these great graphics now that's going to just tell you exactly where you are and how long you've got left, which I know really does help you. Okay, and we're going to kick it out to the side for 15 seconds. So bring it up into that fire hydrant, kicking it out, bringing it back down. You should really be able to start to feel that burn now. Keep it going. Bringing it down. That's it. Okay, let's swap it straight onto the other side. So again, 30 seconds. And you just want to think about lifting your knee up out to the side. Squeeze those glutes as you do. Now, I sometimes get cramp in my foot with this one because I keep my foot really pointed. So just try and relax that foot. That's it, really squeeze, pull those abs in. Okay, you remember what's next? Exactly what we did on the other side. We're gonna pulse it, okay, for 15 seconds. So hold it up here and just pulse. So just lifting that knee up to the ceiling. Yep, I can feel the burn now. You remember what's next? We're gonna take it onto those kicks. Okay, let's go. So bring it down. Kicking it out to the side. Again, 15 seconds of these. God, guys, just think about it. I know it's a long routine, but this is really going to help your butt. And if you do this every day, Miranda Kerr butt is going to be on you. Okay, next exercise. Okay, so if you want to and you do have at home, pick up some weights. We're going to do split squats. So you want your foot or just, you know, probably just where your shin is. And step out and we're just going to squat down. I want to make sure that your knee isn't coming over your toe, okay? So we've got 30 seconds on each side. You might need to adjust yourselves just to get in the right position. But every time you go down, I want you to be able to see that toe. That's it, great. Great job, guys. Let's keep it going. And it's only like 15 minutes out of your day anyway. Get up in the morning. Great way to start your day. Working those glutes. Alfie's working hard. Let's swap over onto the other leg. He is definitely asleep. That's it. So just adjust yourselves and let's go down. Keep that back nice and straight. And if you don't want to use your weights or if you're struggling halfway through, you can put them down. And I bet you the next time you do it, you may be able to hold your weights for longer. Great job, guys. Come on, let's keep it going. 
Excellent. If you've just got a chair at home, you can try it on the chair if you don't have a sofa. Almost done. One more down. Okay, your next exercise. We're going to do a Romanian deadlift, okay? So, I just want your weights out in front of you, so your palms are facing your legs. I'm just going to take one leg out to the back, and we're just going to come down, okay? And we've got 30 seconds on each side. If you can only get to here, that's fine. It's all about progression, okay? If you can get down all the way down to the ground, fabulous. And this is really working this sort of lower part of your glute here. That's it, keep it going. That's it, nice straight back as you get to the top. This is great for your balance too, so try and focus on something in front of you and just take your eye line down. Okay, keep it going. You might want just a slight bend in your knee if you've got sore knees. That's it, keep it going. That's it, keep the back nice and straight as you get to the top. And you're gonna find that one leg is much easier than the other. And I definitely struggle on this side. Alfie, can you tell that I'm struggling on this side? No, he doesn't care. It's snooze time for him. Okay, keep it going, guys. You're doing a great job so far if you're staying with me. That's it, come on, bring it up to the top. Oh, you can see I'm slightly wobbling. Let's take it down for one more and bring it up. Whew, I can really feel my calves as well, they're working. So we're definitely gonna put those weights down for sure. We're gonna come down onto the ground. And again, we've got 30 seconds on each side. Oh, hitting my couch there. We're just gonna lift the leg up and we're gonna pulse, okay? So really think about squeezing those glutes. Again, great thing you can do just watching the TV. That's it, keep it going. It's just a slight little motion, it might not look like much. And again, sometimes my foot cramps up, so just try and relax your foot and the ankle. That's it, really squeeze those glute muscles. Okay, you ready to swap it over? Remember, we've always got to do the other side. And let's take it up straight away. That's it, you're doing great so far, guys. Just think how many minutes you've already been working. And at any time, you're struggling or you need some water, press pause. Don't run away and then come back and try and grab it again. You can just press pause and then you're not going to miss anything. That's a great job, guys. That's it. Pull those tummies in too. Really feel those bums working. Okay, you ready to move on to the next exercise? Okay, let's do it. So, we're just going to come forwards into lunges, okay? So, I like to do my lunges forwards. But you can take them back if you want to. And when you come down, you want to make sure that that knee isn't over the toe. Whew. It's getting hot in here. You can feel my heart rate's getting up. And if you want to, some people like to put their hands on their hips to help with balance. Whatever you're comfortable with. I even used to do it with my arms out to the side. That really helps me get a longer lunge. Okay, we've got a minute of these. That's it, breathe guys. Keep it going. Excellent work so far. You can keep looking at that clock. It's gonna help you with your countdown. And your last lunge. Okay, give those legs a shake. Okay, now my favorite. I want your legs nice and wide, so you're going to be fair, turning your feet outwards and you're going to have your hands on your stomach here, so keep your back nice and straight and we're just going to go really low, okay? We've got a minute of this. This is Alfie's favourite too, he's joining in as you can see. <laughs> That's it, keep it going. Now, after this minute, well less than a minute now, he's gone through the whole workout once. So we're going to go through it all again. but. It's going to be easier because we're only going to be doing it for each exercise for half the time. Okay, so if you manage to get through this, you're going to easily be able to get through the rest of it. It's going to feel like a breeze because each one is just going to be for 30 seconds. Great job. Now when you get down and you come up to the top, think about squeezing those glutes. Really trying to activate the muscle that you're working and that you want to improve. 
Okay, you're almost there guys. Come on, you ready to do it all over again? Remember what was first? The bridge, okay? Straight down on the floor. Just 30 seconds, okay? So hold it up to the top and down. That's if you want to, you can put your arms out to the side, whichever's comfier. That's the thing about squeezing up there for a few seconds, then dropping down. This is gonna help your quads too. And of course, our booty getting it nice and perk because Miranda Kerr has got a pretty nice bottom on her. So if we can get just close to what she's got, I'm gonna be happy. Okay, let's change it over onto your front, onto those fire hydrants, okay? So again, we've just got 30 seconds coming out to the side. And then we're just gonna do 10 seconds of pulses and 10 seconds of those kicks. Okay, see how easy it is. You're getting through the second round super quick. And especially if you've got a workout buddy with you that's motivating you along the way and giving you great encouragement. That's really helpful. So thank you so much, Alfie. Okay, almost there to start those pulses. Are you ready? Let's take it away. So holding up here, just think about lifting that knee up to the ceiling. Oh, if you can't feel the burn in your bum now, I don't think you're doing it right. So you really should be able to feel it. Let's go into those kicks. Again, just 10 seconds. My heart rate is up. I'm burning calories and I'm getting a booty at the same time. Let's swap on to the other side. So 15 seconds. Whew. I'm sweating. I can feel the burn. That's it, keep it going. Make sure that those arms are directly underneath your shoulders. You might need to adjust yourselves. Okay, we're gonna go into those pulses. Let's take those pulses away. In just a second. Okay, keep it going. That's it, squeeze those glutes as you get to the top. Okay, you ready? Let's pulse it. Okay, that's it. Great job, come on, squeeze. Come on, use that energy. Don't think about the pain. Just think about how great your butt's gonna look afterwards. Let's go straight into those kicks. That's it, just a nice motion, kicking it out and bringing it back down. Okay, you ready to go on to the next exercise? Let's go, so pick up those weights if you have them. I'm gonna move my heart cushion out of the way. Very sparkly, I know. I like my house to be nice and pink and fluffy. Okay, and we're gonna take it down. Remember, make sure that knee doesn't go over the toe. In 15 seconds of these. That's it, try and look out in front of you. I know you're probably watching me on your screen. That's it, keep it going. Well, I can feel it, it feels good. Let's swap it over. I tell you what, it's going through it really quickly this time, which feels good. Now let's go. That's it, really making sure that you're looking every time that your knee isn't going over your toe. Excellent job, guys. Come on, just think how well you're doing so far if you manage to keep up. Holding on to those weights. Again, 15 seconds. Dropping them in front of you, and let's go. Now, you should be able to really feel it now, which is why I'm starting to wobble. Means that my muscles are working. And remember, it's when your muscles start to really sort of, uh, uh, sort of like you feel the pain and it's aching, that's when you're actually doing the most work and really toning up your body. So if you can just fight through the pain barrier, it's gonna be worth it in the end. Okay, almost there guys. Come on, stay with me right the way to the end. Okay, put those weights down. Coming onto the ground, I'm gonna do those leg pulses, remember? So hands underneath, lift that leg up, and 15 seconds on each side. Come on, you just got this, the other side, and then sumos. And you're done. You're almost done. And Alfie's definitely done. He's over it already. <laughs> Let's take it up on that other leg. That's it, remember to engage. <sighs> engage those glutes every single time that you're pulsing. Really think about it and pull those tummy in too. <sighs> okay, I've just remembered what's next. 
It's the lunges, okay? <laughs> so coming up to standing, 30 seconds again. Okay, so going down. And I actually feel that if you have your arms out to the side, you can try it at home. It's going to help you do a bigger lunge. It's going to really help your balance as well. And then you've got one more exercise after this. Now, guys, if you've got any questions or comments about, you know, my, what I eat, the uh, exercise regime that I have, then the best way to contact me is on Twitter, at The Model Pilot. I can answer all your questions there. Okay, let's take it down to the sumos. Last exercise, 30 seconds. Let's hold our hands to our tummy. And if you don't have Twitter, you can find me on Facebook. Just put in uh, the facebook.com forward slash Rebecca Louise Fitness. And sometimes I don't always get the comments that are on the videos. So if you want to contact me directly, they're the best two ways. Okay, let's keep it going. Almost finished the whole workout. Now, how quickly did that go? That's it. Give me one more squat to finish. And relax. Okay, shake it out. Whew. How do you feel, Alfie? Yep. Limber, stretched out. He's definitely had a great workout because he's knackered. Whew. Good job, buddy. Good job. Well, that's a longer version of our butt workout. But if you really want to get that body and tone your butt up, then the more exercises you do for the longer, the better the results are going to be. My name's Rebecca Louise. This has been the Victoria Secrets part of their special series. You should check out the rest of them. We've got plenty more for you on Exit. Subscribe to the channel. You can hit this button here. It's going to take you to the newsletter, which has got loads of exciting and fun things for you. Thanks for working out with me today. And make sure you stay fit and keep working out with me again in the future.